The British Curry Awards showcase the best Indian cuisine in the country. It shows just how vital the industry is to our economy that the Prime Minister took the time to tour the kitchen. But chefs like those he spoke to are in short supply since the government tightened immigration policy. Nonetheless, David Cameron promised to back the industry. Let me promise you this. We will work through this together. We'll continue to help you to get the skilled Asian chefs that you need. And we will also work with you to train up the next generation of homegrown chefs. And that was music to the ears of all the people there to celebrate the nation's favorite cuisine. 2.5 million of us eat curry from a restaurant every week. And that's why this annual event is one of the hottest tickets in town. Is when you're away, wherever you are in the world, and you get back to England, the first thing we all do, we don't go, I want to go out for roast beef in Yorkshire, I don't want any chips, I go, I just want to go out for a good old English traditional Indian curry, and we all do it. It's so part of our culture, isn't it? And you know, good old British curry, it really is kind of intrinsic now. Not I'm a Yorkshireman trying to do curry, but uh, there is some amazing talent in the UK now, and um, I, do you know what, I, I, every time I see these chefs that we get on the show, is you try and replicate it and I, you just never can do it exactly the same as them. From the coolest korma to the mightiest madras, there was something here to suit all tastes. And the winner is Great Suspense, uh, Polash Tandoori. And the crowd was full of curry connoisseurs, among them the owners of the nation's favourite takeaway. We are a family business and we've been running for 20 years and to get an award like this is it's an achievement for the family as well as for us and it's like um, it's, it's brilliant, basically. This is the ninth year the event's been running, and Curry's come a long way since the first restaurant opened in England over 200 years ago. And the journey continues.